Hey guys, Jillian Kaplan here from JillianKaplan.com, and today I wanted to come with you, come to you, and tell you a little bit about the difference between country heat and size. So a lot of people have been like, "Hey, Jillian, last summer I remember that you released a program called Size: The End of Exercise um, with Sean T. So what's the deal with this country heat program? Um, it seems like you like it more. Can you tell me why?" So, um, as you guys know, I'm not a dancer <laughs> at all. Um, I have two left feet. I'm a terrible dancer. I don't know what I'm doing. And I did size last summer. Um, size is great because it breaks down every single move for you. So you get to know every single move and then you put it together at the end for a routine. And I really liked it because I felt like um, a dancer in size. Like I felt like I was performing a music video. But that's really hard for a non-dancer to remember like all those moves, basically like 30 plus minutes of moves to put together a routine at the end. So um, sometimes I think people got a little frustrated or off track if they weren't dancers. Um, I personally just am cool with it and like to laugh at myself. Country Heat, um, you only do two steps at a time. So you do step one alone, step two alone, and then you put steps one and two together. And then you do step three alone and step four alone, and then you put steps three and four together. You never put together a whole routine. Um, and you only have to do two steps at a time, which for someone who's a non-dancer is much easier. In Country Heat, they also change the songs um, for every little mini one and two step routine. Um, and in size, you're listening to the same song the whole time, and then you're putting together this music video, if you will, at the end. So that's another difference also. Um, the music in size is more hip hop based. And also I'd say like the dance moves are a little more sexual. Um, so if you were nervous about um, a program you could do with your kids, Country Heat is definitely more family friendly if you have super young kids. I don't think size is overly sexy, but country heat is definitely less sexy, if that makes sense. Um, I don't particularly love country music, but this music is amazing and makes me want to dance around um, for sure. And size is more hip hop based music, which is actually um, my preference, but I really just like country heat um, for me. Um, even though I prefer to listen to like the hip hop music in my car, I feel like I almost like to dance to this country music a little better, just kind of more, I should say, it gets my feet moving. Um, the nutrition plan is the same. So you use the portion control containers, which works amazing. Um, the programs are both 30 days. So they're both a month long, um, a four week plan, which is also great. They have about the same number of routines. Um, and I would say one of the biggest differences and another reason that I prefer Country Heat is because size of the workouts are like 30 minutes up to almost 50 minutes, which if you're used to 30 minute workouts, um, 50 minutes can be a lot more. Um, and Country Heat, the workouts are like 25 to 30 minutes. Nothing's over 30. I think there's one actually that's 32. Um, so you don't have those 50 minute routines or having to figure out how to fit into those 50 minute routines if you only budget for a 30 minute workout like I normally do. So um, that's sort of some of the main differences um, in the two program. So I wanted to share that with you because I've had a lot of questions about that. Um, I liked size. I love country heat. If you are definitely like more of a dancer and you love choreographed moves and you have those 50 minutes, I think that you would like size better for sure. Um, size also um, integrates an ab routine and country heat actually integrates a dance conditioning routine. So it's um, a resistance-based routine that does not require any weights. Um, instead of incorporating an app routine. So that's kind of a slight difference also. So I hope you guys found this helpful. Um, for more fitness tips, you can check out JillianKaplan.com and I will talk to you all later. Bye.